All right, everybody. Some people may have wondered or just interested in this. I had a person, friend of mine, ask about this on a video and how you can go about doing this process. And um, it's just the title of the video. I'm going to be showing how you can play as Austria and Civilization 3 by editing the BIC scenario. So, let's get right into it. Now what you want to do is you want to go to your start menu order. This will only work on Windows because there's no editor for the Mac version of Civilization 3 complete. And there's no Play the World, so. Or there's no, well, Austria isn't in Play the World. It's not in there. Now I gotta find it. Go to Firaxis Games Civilization 3 Conquest Editor. Here we go. Now it's called untitled.bic. Now what you should do first off is go to your computer, program files, for Axis Games, Civilization 3, conquests, conquest.bic. What you'll want to do is copy that and place it on your desktop. The copy is what you're going to edit because you don't want to edit your original because you'll lose whatever civilization you replace. You have to replace a civilization to do this. I hope this is zoomed in. I did not zoom it in. You have to have a civilization replaced to do this. So, here's the editor. So you want to have two of these open. So let me open up a second instance of it. Get two of them open here. I'll open up I'm not going to actually open up conquest.bic. Yeah, I could do it actually if I wanted to. Um, .bic. Then scenario properties. No, that's not it. You want to come up to rules, edit civilizations. And then you want to pick one of these in the list that you want to replace. So in this place, we'll replace the Mayans, so you can replace any of them here. Uh, so you could actually have a scenario for every civilization being replaced by Austria, so you can get the game that you want. And then you'll see all this information in here. Name, uh, city names, culture group, color, that kind of stuff, the free text. Now what you want to do is open up um, Conquest Scenarios and Conquests. Open up Napoleonic Europe. And you'll be in the scenario here. You know, there's Austria right there. So, but that, the map doesn't really mean anything right now. So, uh, uh, you want to come to rules, edit, go to the same place you just went to, civilizations. And then there's Austria in the list. And then you want to take all the information from this page and copy it copy it from your from this into this box here so race Mayans will replace that with Austria for the Civilpedia Austria want to take just copy the whole city name list clear out the one that's in there paste the culture group is European. The diplomacy text index is uh, 26, it looks like. So we'll replace that. You're going to see my head because I'm trying to get in here. Artillery land units that, I don't know if that has to do with the scenario, but I'll put it on. Happiness, production. So turn all that off. They get uh, warrior code as a free tech. Bonuses are militaristic, industrious, and coalition. Oh, that's that's for the um, that's just for the scenario for the Napoleonic Europe. So that doesn't mean anything. The color is white. I can find white in here. 
There it is. Alternate color should be the same. King unit. This one. Oh, this is weird. The king unit is not necessary. Just put none. He's not in the list as far as I'm aware. So king unit, none. Just none. So no regicide here. Copy the uh, scientific leaders, the whole deal. Get rid of the military leaders and put in the ones for the Austrians. Which they got some weird ones in here. People that have nothing to do with the military, really. And then on the forward, the era, whatever. Favorite government is monarchy. And Republican, I think. I think it's Charles the first. I believe so. I think it's just Charles. You can put whatever name you want in here, really. So. Austria and Austrians. I'm sorry this is taking a while. I'm being slow. So basically all the info is the same now except for the forward and reverse file name. Now what you want to do is get rid of the name there. Make sure I don't want to get rid of anything else either. I don't have glasses on so this is why I have to look so close. Charles. In the, and then for animations, go into Middle Ages as well, and just do it for all the eras. So Charles. It's not a simple plot process, really. Um, you do have to kind of get in here with it. Charles. Charles, that's the final one. Okay. Rename them. Now, since I didn't make a copy, I'm going to have to save as scenarios. Mayans replaced with Austria.vic. And I can just close this out because it's not needed anymore. And now my original conquest.vic file is still there. Like I say, back it up though. But then I have. Hey, look! Hey! <laughs> Byzantines under Ben Arlego. That's a, an attempt to recreate that Byzantine game on the Middle Ages scenario. I'll show that in a second video, because you guys may not care about that. That's something on my channel years ago, but Mayans replaced with Austria. So now we're done with all that stuff. Just fire the game up, so come into here. For Axis Games, Civilization 3, Civilization 3 Complete Edition. 
Now to verify that this has worked. Oh, it needs my CD. I didn't think about that one, but. So I gotta go over to the shelf. It's the game. I'm gonna have to end up. Well, hopefully, I don't knock my computer out. Because this is my one, if you guys that watch me know, this is the one that if you take it off the charger, it dies. Need that in anyway. Retry. Hopefully it doesn't fight with me, damn it. <laughs> Boom. Please drive read error. Okay, now it's giving me some crap that I don't need to hear. Huh. I got a lamp here. So this is fun. I'm gonna have to blind you guys for a second. Because I'm not messing with this right now. So, I'm gonna have to. This is not the disc that was wrecked, guys. I threw that away. sure it's in there. Nice and good. I'll go to. If it fucks up now, I'm just going to end the video. It should work just fine. If it doesn't, let me know what's wrong. And I'll try to help. Because this is not... Sometimes, I don't know why, but it doesn't read it properly. The disc. You know, this is why I wish they would just not have all this garbage here. I, I know I could download a no CD crack, but I don't really feel like putting it on this computer. Yeah, I think it's gonna start up now. Let me. Byzantine's under Banner Lego. Because it uses the default rule set, it's going to be the same as just generating a random world. And in the list is Austria with Charles. So that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Yep. Emperor Charles of the Austrians. Fire it up. Vienna. Yep. New city founded. Vienna. I know you guys don't really want to see gameplay, but just to show that it does work here. Ron's working. Oh wow, Settler. Just found a second city that actually works out so I can show another city name. Just automate the worker. Salzburg. Nice. See, it works just fine. And then, uh, advisors. Foreign advisor. This does not show... I believe that there's a way that you can make your own of this. This just does not work. And also, there's no actual... If I go to Civilization... Tribes. Oh, the, it does show the Austrians, it just doesn't show the leaderhead. There is a way to get that in, but it doesn't actually affect gameplay. So... I'll retire. Yeah. 
That'll hurt race Austria. You do have to do that. You have to create your own for it to work entirely. But it is enough that you can play the game with Austria. Um, start up again. So I can show you that we still have the mines on the original. New game. Yep, and there, it put me on the same spot, and there's the Mayans, so. Yep, <laughs> works perfectly. Other than the fact that you do need to do your own Civilopedia. Uh, you can just put whatever bullshit text you want in there, or you can make it uh, actual, like, Austrian text. I believe that there is something, if you look up online, there was some real text that was in the game files, but I don't know how to get to it. But that's basically all you really need to do in order to make it work, so... I hope this helped you. Um, if anybody wants... I'll do a video on the Civilopedia thing, or try to, but that's basically all there is for this part of it, and catch you guys later.